HR pros have a lot on their plates and dates are just one of the many responsibilities you can't afford to miss. That's why this year I've decided to begin each month with an HR FAQ devoted to important dates, holidays, and compliance deadlines for that month. So what key dates in May does HR need to know? Let's get started. Here's a preview of upcoming dates, which we'll explain more in a moment. May is Global Employee Health and Fitness Month. May 15th, Nonprofit Tax Returns Deadline, including Form 990. May 29th, Memorial Day. I'll link to the official forms in the description. Now, let's take a closer look at what these dates are referring to. What is Global Employee Health and Fitness Month? Global Employee Health and Fitness Month is a great opportunity to start a wellness program. Wellness programs are workplace initiatives designed to improve and promote health and fitness. One reason to consider helping workers improve their health is the rising costs of healthcare and coverage in 2023. According to Mercer's 2022 National Survey of Employer-Sponsored Health Plans, employers anticipated an average 5.6% rise in sponsored health plan costs in 2023 compared with 4.7% in 2022. For more information, check out these links in the description on how to create a wellness program and how to incentivize vaccination with wellness credits. What is Form 990? Form 990 is an IRS reporting document used by tax-exempt organizations, non-exempt charitable trusts, and Section 527 political organizations to provide information that is required by Section 6033. What is Memorial Day? Memorial Day is a holiday celebrating the men and women who have served and fallen in our country's military service. Memorial Day is May 29th. As private organizations are not required to give Memorial Day off, it is important for HR to update employees and ensure they are aware of your policies. What does HR need to look forward to in June? Since it's helpful to know some dates before the month begins, I want to mention that June 19th is Juneteenth and June 30th is the end of Q2. I'll cover this and other June dates to know in further detail during next month's episode. But until then, check out Bernie Portal's downloadable HR Calendar 2023. That's it for this HR FAQ. If you wanna learn more HR best practices, subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notifications about the latest HR Party of One and HR FAQ episodes. As always, thanks for watching.